we're going to do an infusion, or better known as tea. I've chose to do spearmint tea, or spearmint infusion. What we're going to need is have this little glass container and this MSR strainer. We're going to put one, we need a teaspoon, and have a teacup with some honey in it and a spoon. We're going to put one teaspoon of the cotton sifted spearmint into here. And then we're going to boil some distilled water. And with this strainer, it has a cover, so this will keep all the essential oils inside because spearmint has essential oils and we want to capture those. So that's why we're going to use this particular strainer. Start the water and then we'll be back. As the water is heating up, we'll go over some of the historical uses of spearmint. It can be used to strengthen your memory, helping your strength, just as a refreshing drink, for scabs, for skin eruptions, to repress mother's milk, as a digestive aid, for vomiting, hiccups, bad breath, sore gums, sore mouth, helps with your memory, prevents what we call kidney stones or other types of stones in your urinary tract. It's good for colds, flus, fevers, indigestion, gas, cramps, spasms, colic, uh, again uh, stones that could be in your bladder, urinary tract and for hemorrhoids and asthma. I, I enjoy spearmint to drink better, better than the peppermint. I think it has a better flavor than peppermint. We're gonna let this uh, distilled water heat up and then pour it in here. And we'll wait 10 minutes for it to steep and then we'll come back. Okay, the water's hot, we're gonna Pour it in here. Put the cover on and we'll let it steep for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, we'll come back and show you how to filter it. So this has been steeping for about 10 minutes. Just gonna pull this filter up. So down the plate. I'm gonna pour this in here with the honey. Stir the honey in. Is a wonderful spearmint tea. Thank you. I'm gonna sit here and enjoy this tea. Hope you all enjoyed learning about how to make herbal infusions.